Hey guys, it's Paul with CP Addict again. We're here with uh, Pat Milligan in his 96 F250 uh, crew cab power stroke. We're at the uh, St. Louis area power strokes event in uh, Villa Ridge, Missouri. He's uh, He's been kind enough to bring his truck out and do an interview with us on on, uh, on this truck. We met what, probably seven to seven to ten years ago, roughly something like that. Somewhere in there. Finally, finally, kind of face to face. So we've been we've been doing this a while, and your truck is kind of taking shape from there. Um, kind of tell us about like where the truck came from and you know, why you have this passion for this truck. I guess is what we. Well, first to start off, I've always always been into Fords. I've had Fords my whole life. <laughs> I need, I needed a truck. As can be seen with your Facebook page. Exactly. Uh, this truck's a '96. I bought it in '98. It had 52,000 miles on it when I bought it. And it's got 340 on it now. So you, it, it's been the staple of your household or your your driving for probably what, 20 years. Right? 20 years or so. 20 years. So like. Why this truck? Why did you buy this? You know, what did you see in this truck when you passed it? You know, well, we decided. My, my wife and I decided we were going to buy a fifth wheel camper. So if, prior to this, I had a half ton truck, and I knew I needed to go to a diesel to be able to pull my fifth wheel camper. Right. And you know, I had a family at the time, planning on going to a bigger family. So we got a truck that had two more doors than the one I started out. with. <laughs> uh, we just kind of. Kind of drove kinda, by and saw kinda, it sitting on a lot. And it kind of just like jumped out at you. That I like is, black. This is <laughs> black always looks good, especially yeah. all cleaned up. Now I know over the last years, you know, especially since I've met you, there's there's been quite a few changes to the truck to to personalize it and and I don't know how better else to describe it, but make this your own expression of yourself because you're like me, and I think like a lot of other people in the aspect of these trucks just don't get you from point A to point B. They are part of you. They they say something about you in your your day to day and, and when you're driving down the road people know, hey that's that's Pat going down the road. Or at least somebody that's really close to Pat. It's nobody else driving that truck. It it can't be mistaken with anybody else. And you know with it being you, know, you said three hundred how many thousand miles? Three hundred forty. Three hundred and forty thousand miles you you've had it for pretty much most of this life. You've had it for 300,000 miles, basically. And, you know, it's, I won't say it's not left you stranded because that's a, that's a whole other story that we've, we've talked about before, but it, it has, it has done the job that you bought it to do and it's still doing that job to this day, uh, you know, with, with proper maintenance and proper, proper care given to the truck. And it, it, it has gone the distance for you. Um, so I know you've done, you know, quite a few things to, to, to make it personalized and make it make it yours, you know, being the wheels and tires and all that. We'll kind of do another episode on that of in-depth of what you've got, but uh, we do appreciate you bringing the truck out and, and talking to us about it. Well, thanks, thanks a bunch for Thank coming you. Out. So, As always, guys, if you like our content, don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have a truck you want us to do a feature on, or a video of a product or something OBS related that you would like to see us do, please feel free to email us at info at CPAddict and drop a comment in the comment section. Thanks. Thanks.